We spent two weeks at the Orlando Thousand Trails RV Park in January 2016. It is located in southwest Orlando, in Claremont, Florida, about a 30 minute drive from Disney and 45 minutes into the city. There's a Walmart down the street and plenty of shopping amenities nearby. The park is the largest campground we have ever stayed in, with almost 900 sites. The sites were large and easy to access, even with a large fifth wheel or Class A motorhome. Most of the campground is located in open areas with sparse trees. However, one section is forested where you have trees between the sites. All of the roads are paved and many of the sites offer paved parking or a cement slab. Most of the sites were 30 amp full hookup with some 50 amp available. The one of the newer sections was all 50 amp, but cost an additional $3 per night to stay there. There are a few cabins available to rent on site, and some small upscale trailer homes with full-time residents. Being so large, the park offered a lot of amenities and activities. There was an event going on almost every day we were there, including RV shows, bingo, vendors, presentations, tournaments, and more. It has a very nice activity center with a ballroom, game room, and store. Just outside the activity center, they have two pools, a hot tub, and waiting pool, shuffleboard courts, horseshoe pits, volleyball, tennis and pickleball courts, an exercise room, kids play area, miniature golf, giant chess and checkers, nature trails great for walking, and a fenced dog park area. They also have two fishing ponds, and their own on-site lake. Boats are available to use, however swimming would be discouraged because there are gators. Laundry and bathhouse facilities were within walking distance from each section, and they were clean, newer, and in good condition. Trash and recycling was collected only in one location at the center of the park, but they had very large collection bins. A few sections of the park, including one bathhouse, were under construction, but they had closed the whole section as not to inconvenience guests. It was nice to see they were putting money back into the park to keep it updated. Propane fill is available, as well as a coin-operated vacuum, dump station, and on-site RV storage. Wi-Fi is also available at the park, and the signal appeared to be strong everywhere. Cell service was good for us on AT&T, Sprint, and Verizon. Mail was received at the activity center daily and worked very well. Mailboxes are also available to seasonal and full-time residents. Overall, we had a great experience at this campground and found it to be well-maintained and managed. As part of the Thousand Trail system, we think this campground is an excellent value. Please subscribe to our channel for more reviews, tips, tricks, and to follow our RV adventures. Also check us out at mortonsonthemove.com.